It's a beautiful day on Lake Brunner and it's an amazing lake. A jewel in the crown on the west coast, but water quality is declining from increased farm runoff. We're in the small mucky pond. What's happened here? Yeah, you can certainly see the, uh, the evidence of the, the sludge coming down here, but this area here was itself um, subject to some unconsented or, or activities beyond a consent in humping and hollowing or land development. It released a large amount of sediment into a small drain which then got inundated and ended up in the lake. Increasingly for us the story is one of degradation and mismanagement and really we need help with keeping this place the way it is. So how many students are you bringing here? What do you do with them? We'll bring students here several times a year. We have a student group of about 40 or 50 depending on the year and they are sea kayaking here. We use um, this venue to train our students to, to look after other people outside as well. So all the high schools on the west coast bring their students here so our students can take them on camps and they'll spend up to a week here moving around the lake. And how have you noticed the lake changing over your lifetime? Well, as a young child, I used to check here all the time, you know, kayak around uh, and so forth. Um, I guess changing around, I mean, as you can see, a lot of the, the trees around here, the willows have been killed off. Um, and just in general, I suppose, you know, the quality of it. Um, I wouldn't say I used to drink it as a kid, but mm. definitely changed. So what's your vision, Natu Wawa's vision for the, for the lake? Well obviously on a kaitiaki perspective, you know, definitely looking after it for our future generations. And so if we can't do that today, then there's not going to be anything here for future generations. How do you think water quality on the west coast can be improved? Well, for a start, in this lake, water quality is still considered good, but it is declining. Um, more enforcement by the Regional Council of, of Regional Rules and enforcement of those through prosecutions. What do you think needs to change to do that? Well, obviously the water quality, the, you know, stronger restrictions on the, the fender on the outside of it, you know, the triptys coming in and so forth. Um, council needs to up up the game a bit and I think so do our people. West Coast Regional Council needs robust rules, it needs to enforce those rules and we need strong national policies and rules to protect fresh water.